Well, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, floating among the clouds of Venice, we are joined by somebody who thousands of you have written to me about in the last 24 hours saying, I want to be there with her, Christine. Hello. Hello, John. We miss you. I miss you too. The, I don't. I want to be there. I will be there in New York. But my goodness me, the comments that I've been hearing of, uh, about the ship have been epic. Tell us what you've been hearing from the guests on board. Well, we've had an opportunity for me. It's been great spending so much time with many of our platinum and diamond guests who sail with Carnival all the time. And I think everyone agrees this ship is just a fantastic addition to the Carnival Cruise Line fleet. She's really an elegant version of our Vista class, has a lot of her own unique and special touches and experiences and areas. The Bellagio restaurant um, has been a big hit. People are loving that. Of course, our Frizzante bar, the Amara bar, really leaning into how to choose fun Italian style. Beautiful pool deck. We also added another bar, uh, the Pergola bar. So lots of additions in food and certainly bar and lounge areas. Um, still have fun water slides for the kids. And we've been having a blast, of course, with our chief culinary officer, Emeril Lagasse, who's sailing with us uh, for these uh, first few days. And I, I know from having been with you on board a ship, you are a mega super rock star and <laughs> by far the most popular and loved cruise ship president in the entire industry. And that's just the truth it is you you just exude everything about fun so how is it for you to be constantly with the photo and the crew as well because you're like a mega rock star to the crew as well how do you handle all of that what keeps you going christine well, there's not enough hours in the day. And as you said, I love to spend time with our crew. I visit almost every one of our ships every year, but I don't really have as much time with the guests like you do, John. And since you're not here, I am doing my part to try to fill the gap, but it's hard. I don't know how you do it. Uh, I really enjoyed meeting so many people who, of course, are asking for you. Uh, we look forward to seeing you in New York, but all is well on Carnival Venezia. We have a day at sea. The spa is fantastic. We have a new blow-dry bar I and nail salon. Hello, gorgeous. Uh, the atrium is gorgeous. We have a uh, non-smoking casino for those who'd like to play without the smoke. And uh, what can I say? I think this is going to be a big hit. Um, we're very grateful to our sister brand, Acosta, uh, for creating such a beautiful ship. I know all of our guests in the U.S. are really going to enjoy her. I just, I, I just want to press fast forward because I, I know you're very busy, so I don't want to take up a lot of time. But I want to press fast forward a little bit because we have Carnival Jubilee coming, of course, and we'll be giving her lots of fanfare as well. But um, I had a, a guest, a couple of guests write to me in the last few days, and they are desperately trying to get on uh, this ship. They're looking to buy other cruises to, you know, with us. And a lot of the cruises that we have are sold out. Now, that leads me into the question of how are things for us now? Let's take a breath from Venezia and look that way. How are things booking wise and how are we standing as a cruise line? Because I want everybody watching this to, to see and hear where we are at the moment. Well, as you know, Carnival is back big time and we are so blessed and excited to be welcoming so many guests back on board and also welcoming new guests. Um, it's all over the media. Cruise ships are full. Cruising is back. And Carnival really led the way. As you know, we were the first major cruise line to bring every ship back with the addition of ships like Carnival Luminosa, now Venezia, soon to be Jubilee, of course, our beautiful flagship celebration, and Firenze, the sister to this ship. We always said you want to book early. And so while I know people are a bit disappointed they can't get exactly what they want for 23, our inventory is open 
through the first half of 25. 24 is open, but booking fast. So we're getting the word out to our travel agents, um, to our cruisers, book early. You've seen pricing go up over these last couple of uh, months uh, for Carnival. And so that demand is there. We're really, really thrilled and excited. And we think with the new uh, ships that we're bringing in with Carnival, Venezia, Jubilee coming, uh, I think it's just going to continue. Well, that's a, an important message there. If you know you want to cruise, book it now because we are, thanks to all of you and all of our crew and, of course, Christine, we are looking good and we cannot wait to welcome you if you're watching this, uh, whether it's on uh, the Carnival Elation all the way through to Carnival Jubilee. We can't wait to see you. And it's great to hear such positive news. And I've one more question. It's the most important question. And I promised dozens of people i would ask you i posted a photo of me standing next to you in the barcelona terminal yesterday i was ignored in the same way i've ignored salad bars for many years and all they wanted to know was where does christine get her clothes why doesn't she have her own clothing line so now i know you've got your jewelry line i'm not this isn't me this isn't i'm telling you read the comments there you've got your own wonderful jewelry line at, at effie and we should give that a mention it's called Oh, return to see SEA. And I met a lovely woman today whose birthday is in November. She was buying a beautiful birthstone ring. I met another woman at the Diamond Lunch who had bought one of our stackable rings from Effie. Yes. And you yep. know, we've got we've also got some fantastic retail on this ship. So in addition, we've got our goes around, comes around, handbag and wallet collection. But you know. Maybe I do need to start a clothing line. I think I'm I could sell my jacket from yesterday for quite a bit. Yes. And 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 I had honestly loads of people, Christine, please start a clothing line. And I did <laughs> film I did film in the gift shop yesterday and those red jackets the crew are wearing, they've got similar in the shops. They're gonna add. So watch this space, everybody. The Christine Duffy clothing line <laughs> coming soon. I mean, nobody's asked for what I wear. Well, I'm, wear I'm wearing today. This is my patriotic for our Heroes Tribute Bar, which is brand new, opened uh, on Venezia. And we had a, a meeting with all of our uh, veterans and uh, active military uh, today on board. And that's something else that, as you know, John, is near and dear to my heart and near and dear to the entire Carnival family. Uh, we have also raised... A uh, nice amount of money for St. Jude Emerald, been hosting a group of people um, who contributed. Uh, and so we'll be making a nice donation to St. Jude. Wonderful. And there is a gentleman on board I mentioned earlier. And uh, if he's watching this, he's offered $1,000 for St. Jude if you will sit in the gondola with him. I'll just leave that right there. Okay. Well, he'll have to find me and I have to get permission because we're not allowed to sit in the gondola. Oh, maybe, get maybe maybe we could stand next to it. I'll have to negotiate. We'll negotiate that one. Thank you but for your time, it's Christine. It's beautiful, as you can it see, is, this beautiful dining room. It's absolutely stunning. Christine, I want to thank you. I know how busy you are. I wish I could be there. And on behalf of the thousands of people who will see this, we truly thank you for being the dedicated, incomparable president you are. And on a personal note, thank you for your kindness to me. Thank you. Ladies and Thank gentlemen. Thank you, John. We'll see you in New York. You Thank, you, York Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Bye-bye.